guys welcome back to my channel I am feeling like so peppy today I don't know if it's just because I don't have either of the kids today so I feel so relaxed and I'm actually like enjoying filming instead of squeezing it into a nap I honestly don't know what it is but I'm so excited for today's video I'm so excited to try all these items on from Target they have a lot of new fall arrivals in including this sweatshirt that I'm wearing and I'm obsessed, so I actually haven't tried anything on. This will be all my first impressions as always. Before we get started, I do wanna thank Ana Luisa for sponsoring today's video. I have some new pieces from them that I wanna share with you guys. Every single time I receive an order from them, I swear I find a new favorite of mine. It's like every time I'm thinking I could never love another piece as much as I love this one and then my next order comes in and I'm like well anyway I wanted to share with you guys the new pieces and let you know that their entire website is 20% off right now so highly recommend I'm gonna put the link right at the top of the description so you guys cannot miss it so I highly recommend checking out their site right now just because that's such a great deal they have really nice sustainable jewelry starting at $39 so I always say there's something for everyone but truly as far as price point and styles they just have some that are so simple so affordable um, but then they also have more like statement pieces and things that are very unique like this necklace that I'm wearing and I can't wait to show you guys close ups also for anyone's birthday or anything like that I'm always gifting them Ana Luisa jewelry because I love it so much that I just can't imagine somebody else not loving it okay so the first piece I want to show you is this ring so this is the Cody ring and how adorable and simple but like still eye-catching it's so cute so I got mine in a size 6 which I do feel like is true to size I feel like their sizing is very true to size this little curl just kills me lately it's like all I look at in the viewfinder um let me just tuck that guy but yeah it's very comfortable on my finger and like I said I do think that it's true to size I can actually fit it on my middle finger as well so I'm trying to figure out what finger it looks best on but it would also look really cute with like other rings on your hand if you really wanted to like stack them up so this is what it looks like close up it's just very simple but just so pretty and I absolutely love it okay and then this necklace is the Hannah necklace I have been patiently waiting for this and I absolutely love it this is definitely a new favorite of mine it's got this like opalescent kind of pearl-esque uh, center to it with like a flower engraved and I just think that it is beautiful it looks so vintage and I genuinely just absolutely love it I'm covering it with my hand so hopefully you guys can see it a little bit better and get that detail so I definitely wanted to mention those because I'm gonna be wearing them throughout this video and I always get questions on my jewelry by the way these are also Ana Luisa and again I will have that link at the top of the description bar for you guys so lastly before we jump in all of the links will be down below as always with my sizing and whatnot I do want to let you guys know that when you click on my links down below in the description bar to order an item I make a very small commission off of each order so I wanted to thank you guys for using those links that really allows me to keep putting these videos out for you guys so yes I just wanted to say thank you and let you guys know that in case you didn't know and let's get right to it okay starting off guys this sweatshirt is definitely a new favorite sweatshirt of mine I haven't even like taken the tag off yet but I am absolutely keeping this I got mine in an extra small it's a really nice like fuzzy kind of fleecy material on the inside but what I like about this is it's actually like fairly thin it's not like overly heavy I just absolutely love that about it it's like warm and cozy but it's not too heavy and it's literally perfect for fall it does say Brooklyn on it this reminds me so much of the sweatshirt that I got last year at Target it's like kind of like a washed uh, dark green color and then it says NYC on it I wear it all the time if you guys follow me on Instagram you know I wear that sweatshirt all of the time and this reminds me so much of that that sweatshirt has been out of stock forever now um, but I still get questions on it every single time I wear it so if you are one of my followers on Instagram you like that NYC sweatshirt I highly recommend this one it reminds me so much of that sweatshirt I love that this one has the tie-dye but I like that it's um, also like neutral colors so untucked it is kind of like a tunic length if I almost want to go back and get a small and just size up one just so it really hangs like a bit lower I can't decide though because this really is like I don't know the perfect oversized look I just really like mine to kind of cover my bum if I'm only gonna wear it with leggings so I don't know if I'm gonna get the small or keep the extra small I love it nothing bad to say about it highly recommend and then on the bottom I have these ribbed leggings so I'm hoping that I can get it so you guys can see the texture so these are like a really nice ribbed material I got these in an extra small I want to start with the band at the top because it's amazing and it's like super contouring very snug and comfortable it reminds me a bit of like Spanx almost um, it's crazy to say that because these are $15 from Target, but also I'm on my period, so 
I got like a little bump going on here, but yeah, I just absolutely love this band at the top. I will say that my um, quads are kind of like maxing it out. These are super stretchy to a point and then they're like not stretchy anymore. So I can barely pull any slack here. I do have more like athletic legs. So I think if you had um, thinner legs, then I think these would be totally fine on you. Um, the longer I have them on, the more comfortable they are. It was just like when I was pulling them up, you know, when you can start to feel like something's going to be a little snug. I definitely felt that with these. I did get these in the gray as well. And the gray feel like they are like unlimitedly stretchy. So I think I'm going to like those even more. And I just really, really love this texture. I just think it adds a little bit of interest to the outfit and just makes them a little bit different. Um, I just paired this outfit with my blowfish sneaks and yeah, just super casual. Love it, love it. The sweatshirt must, must have. Okay, so I just tucked this t-shirt into my bra because I really want you guys to be able to see these leggings. They are everything. So I apologize. This shirt is not from Target. Um, this is actually from a local restaurant called Pepino. So if they sell online or something, I will definitely link them below. But I just threw it on because it was like the first t-shirt in my drawer. So anyway... These are the gray leggings, the same exact ones, and I got these in an extra small as well. Guys, these are so good. They're so good. I could actually, like, work out in these. Literally, not only do I want to lounge in them, but I want to work out in them. They are so, so good. So, I have this really nice, like, compression band here, which is still, like, stretchy, but it just, like, really sucks you in. And again, it's a really nice ribbed material, but these are much stretchier, like... Can you guys see like how much stretchier? I don't feel like my quads are maxing out in these, which actually the longer I had the black ones on, the uh, more I liked them. I didn't mind that feeling as much. They look so good. They feel so good. These leggings are just everything. So I'm definitely glad I tried the gray pair on. Um, they're just not sliding around. They're not going anywhere. I could run in these. I could um, weight train in these. I could do yoga. Okay, next up, I feel like I have the perfect transition outfit into fall. So I have this bodysuit on, which was $15. I got it in an extra small. Um, I will say, I definitely think they could have got this to like the $10 or $12 price mark. I think that would have made it um, even better. Not that it's not good. I mean, it's got a lot of detail to it. It's just like the fabric is just kind of like a plain, like thin cotton. So I, I don't know. I'm just, I was kind of surprised it was $15. Regardless, I do think it's really cute. It's very flattering. I like that it's like a little bit low cut. I love this little ruffle detail and the floral design on it. And I also love how it pairs with this sweater um, and this necklace. This necklace is like everything with this top. I feel like it makes this whole outfit. But And the bodysuit is a thong in the back. So um, if you see any lines, it's actually my underwear because obviously I'm wearing my underwear. These jeans are by Wild Fable. I got these in a size double zero. I could tell just holding these up that these were going to fit me perfectly and they 100% do like these are amazing the color and like the wash isn't something I would normally go for it's a little bit lighter than what I would normally go for but I'm almost willing to compromise and make these work I think they would actually look super cute with like a band t-shirt something like a little bit darker on top but I'm 100% gonna see what other colors they have these available in because the fit is perfect like the fit is absolutely perfect, and for 22 bucks, these would definitely be um, like a new favorite pair of jeans for me. The waist is like nice and high-waisted and nice and snug up here, but then I feel like it's loose where they're supposed to be loose. And yeah, I mean, I do like this color. It's just kind of growing on me. And again, I have my Blowfish sneakers on, and then I threw on this cardigan by Universal Thread. I love this. It's just a good basic cardigan. It's got like the big pockets on the sides and just some like detailing going on here. Super soft. I got mine in an extra small. It's like perfectly oversized. Although you could size up probably one more if you want it even more so, but I think this is perfect. And I think this would be really good with leggings and like a band t-shirt and sneakers or something like that. So yeah, I love this. And they had this in multiple colors as well. So really good basic cardigan. Good for work or home or weekend. I just feel like you need a sweater like this in your closet. So that is that look. Okay, next up, another bodysuit. So this one is at the $10 price point, which I think is much more reasonable. I love this one actually so much more than I thought I would. And by the way, I just took the straps on my bra and like tucked them in. So this definitely isn't like a strapless bra and you can kind of see it's like a little lumpy back there where the straps are. But um, I really love this color and these straps are like a stretchy like elastic material and I just really like the neckline. They had this in black, nude, um, I don't know, like a handful of different colors. So I just went with this one to mix it up a little bit, but I actually really, really love it. And I got a spray tan today too, so I feel like it just looks really nice with a fresh tan. And this bodysuit's not as much of a thong in the back. It's just kind of like super cheeky, but um, I'm actually not seeing 
any lines in my jeans so that's good but these jeans are by universal thread i shared these last fall i think um in a try on haul and i just love them they have been some of my favorite jeans since and they're perfect to pair with something like fitted on top because they do have that like straight fit um, and like a lot of distressing and stuff so just something kind of classic and fitted on top is usually how i style these jeans but I love these. I love the fit. I'm not sure if these are still in stock and if they're not, I have a pair by Universal Thread that fit almost identical, but they just don't have like the distressing and they're in different washes. So I'll link whatever I can for you guys down below, but I paired it with my strappy uh, white wooden heels from Target. I never really know what to call these. I actually have these in the snake skin as well, but yeah, very simple, but easy to throw on like a leather jacket or again, a big cardigan like I just had on that would be really cute over something like this. Simple cute okay i always love to include some really fun more fashion forward pieces in my haul so this top really stuck out to me i love these ruffles it's got this really pretty like embroidered um pattern on it as well and they have this in a couple different colors this is actually in a small i do think it would be better in an extra small but once i tucked it in it's actually super cute and like flattering from the side as well so i may actually keep the small if not i am 100 percent ordering the extra small i just think this top is so cool so fun and it would be something that i'd really look forward to like wearing also super comfortable and lightweight but i think this would be really cute paired with like a pencil skirt to wear to work or with some like white jeans and little like white booties or something i think that would be really kind of fun and sassy but yeah i just absolutely love the detail of this top i think it looks very expensive the way the ruffle goes all the way around i love the color and just a fun kind of unique piece the top itself is pretty boxy it just kind of like comes to here and it's just straight down um so i definitely think it's like a perfect top to tuck in especially where there's a lot of fabric up here you know tucking it in really brings in your waist so i just have it on again with those straight jeans and um the little white strappy shoes that i had on but definitely a fave from this haul so for those of you guys who kind of like the ruffle trend but don't want something so roughly like the last top i think you might really like this one this is like a really nice um kind of like a thicker material so a really perfect again transition piece for fall I really, really love this. I actually didn't expect to like it as much as I do. That's just kind of a trend with like trying things on. That's why I think these videos are great and super helpful because a top that you might um, walk right by may end up being something you really love if you were to see it on or try it on yourself. So I just love all the detail in this top. I like the way this necklace pairs with it again. I just kind of love um, the vintage vibes of this top and the little pleats in the front. Was the camera even still on me? My gosh. For some reason, I feel like I am having trouble focusing today, but I love the way it tucks in. Very flattering. Again, I got a size small. I would normally get an extra small, but I think this is pretty good. I think I could have got away with the extra small as well. It is a little bit big down and through here. So yeah, probably the extra small would have been better. I would say it is true to size. I still have just my jeans and shoes um, on from before for sake of time, but it does look really cute. Although you could style this a million different ways. This top would look really cute tucked into some like work slacks or again, like a pencil skirt for work or something like that. And just give a little extra detail and kind of, I don't know, flirtiness to your outfits. Okay. So this is for my girls going to like a country concert or something like that. If you're lucky enough to be getting out to an event, I think this is literally like the perfect outfit for a country concert. So I have this adorable dress on. I actually am not wearing a bra at all just because it's like super um like laced up in the back I'm doing a really bad job but yeah it's got like some lace up detail in the back so i definitely felt like i couldn't wear a bra but if i was actually gonna wear this out i would probably just wear a sticky bra or if i was wearing a sweater like this i'd just wear a strapless bra anyway it's super cute it's got these kind of funky floral colors on it and i did add a belt which i will also link this is from um target i think it's universal thread it came in like a set of three but it's got this cute little like dropped waist with a ruffle and then the bottom of the skirt is just really cute it's kind of like uneven and i think the hem is really what gives it that just like country feel my boots are from walmart they're by scoop they're just like little white snakeskin booties um with like a brown little heel um which is super cute for like a country concert or something like that i think it looks adorable with this dress and with this sweater over the top just in case it gets chilly um, or you know just transitioning into fall like, I think this looks really cute together so yeah the dress is definitely something I didn't love until I put the belt on and, but I just really didn't like like the dropped waist on me but with the belt I think it works I definitely wish I had a concert to wear this too okay, I have a few more dresses to show you guys and this one is actually super cute it's just not in a color I would normally choose for a dress like this so they had it in white which is the color that I really wanted but I do really like this color and again I think it looks really nice with a tan so if you are more of um, a colorful person as far as like your fashion sense you probably will really love this color 
but this dress is super cute it's a little bit more of like a structured material but it's still very lightweight I think this would be adorable for like family photos or something like that um, or if you're like having newborn photos taken and you're gonna be like holding your baby I always think dresses like this would be really cute just because there's like a lot of kind of like detail going on up here at the top with like the sleeves and it's got this really pretty like embroidery going on so yeah I just feel like this would be really cute like holding a newborn baby and having like close-up pictures of this while still being like very covered so that's like totally a random thought I don't know if anyone out there is watching this looking for a, a dress to wear for their newborn photos but anyway I think it's super cute and really good for pictures just in general I think this would be adorable in like a field for family photos something like that but also as like guest of wedding or just kind of any dressier event that you have I also feel like you could probably throw this on with sneakers if you were like a bit taller for me it was just like the dress and then sneakers there was like no legs showing but if you're like 5'6", five, 5'7", five, or taller, I think this would be really cute with just some like flat white sneakers to make it more casual. Um, it does have pockets in case I did not mention that. But yeah, it's just a really adorable tiered maxi and I absolutely love it. They had it in a couple different colors. The white, like I said, was the one I had my eye on. But uh, yeah, this one is really fun. For shoes, just going with that dressier trend, I have my Steve Madden snakeskin. Uh, what ones are these? I literally looked up the name for these last night and... I've already forgotten it so anyway this isn't an extra small by the way I definitely would say go true to size because it's already oversized so if you go a size up then you might just be swimming in it okay next up even a little bit dressier is this dress I adore this dress of course I love the ruffle shoulders and it's got this really pretty lace detailing going on at the top as well they had this in a couple different colors they had like a really pretty kind of dusty grayish blue which was just stunning again a great dress for like guest of wedding or for family photos anything like that or just any formal event you may have I kept my same Steve Madden shoes on uh, but this color is just stunning this is my universal thread by the way and I got it in an extra small I like that this ruffle shoulder is kind of like statementy but it's not over the top it still feels very flattering and it is like full coverage in the back too so you can wear whatever bra you feel most comfortable with, but I just think this is stunning. It definitely looks more than, I think it was $29.99 and for sure looks more than that. So, so pretty. Okay, next up is a dress that is really not like anything I've ever tried on on my channel, but I really, really love it. And I cannot explain how comfortable this dress is. I don't know what it is about it. It's just so comfortable and it's super cute. I feel like you could wear this to work or you could really dress it up and wear it to, again, an event or something like that. But um, it's got some really nice shape to it, like through the body. It is pretty boxy, but it definitely looks intentional. It looks like the style of the dress. I love these big puff sleeves. These are definitely more of a statement sleeve. They're not very subtle at all. Um, but I just really love it and they're really comfortable. They have like a sleeve within this sleeve and this dress also has pockets, which is awesome. I love the v-neck because again, I'm always wearing layered jewelry. So I like kind of showing that off, especially where this dress is very oversized. It's nice to just kind of show like a little bit of your collarbones and stuff. It just kind of like elongates your body and then it has this adorable ruffle at the bottom and it's just a really nice lightweight material. I have it on with again, my Steve Madden little snakeskin shoes, but just a cute option, something I wanted to show a little bit different, very, very cute. Okay, last look guys, I really wanted to cozy it up and do a strictly fall look as if it's 40 degrees out. So I saw this jacket at Target and fell in love. I love the colors. I did get it in an extra small and it is very oversized. So definitely get your true size. But this jacket was $50 and I just think that is such a great price. This is actually quite thick and it has like a lining as well um, I love this like scrunch sleeve at the wrist it just gives it like I don't know a cool um, vibe and I'm just really into this I've seen a ton of jackets like this and they are much more expensive like upwards of $150 so I felt like 50 bucks was actually pretty good and I just threw on like a basic shirt and my faux leather leggings from Spanx which these are still available as part of the Nordstrom anniversary sale. I will link these. Um, I'll link them on the Spank site if not. They were part of the Nordstrom sale um, for like $65 or something. Something crazy. They're normally $98. So yeah, I will um, definitely link the best price I can find down below. But I love these. I wear them constantly in the fall. They are my number one most worn item in the fall. I actually just ordered a new pair of these same exact ones, same exact size and everything. So yeah. They're definitely a must-have, but 
I thought it would definitely add some texture with this coat. I thought the faux leather would just look nice. And then just some sneakers on bottom. Definitely comment down below, guys. Let me know if you want me to start doing like fall shoes. I keep throwing on my sneakers because that's generally like how I transition into fall. Yeah, are you guys interested in seeing like new boots and stuff? Because I will definitely uh, try to pick some up. But anyway, yeah, definitely recommend this jacket. It's so good. It's got functioning pockets in the front. It actually has three. It has two down here and one up here. So just kind of nice to throw your phone in a chapstick in or whatever. And I think this is so cute. I was not planning on keeping it because I'm like, oh, I don't need another jacket. Jackets are like my downfall. I feel like I have a lot of jackets, but this one's so good. It might just be making its way into my closet. So love it. Okay, guys, that is absolutely it for today's video. I really hope you enjoyed it. Again, don't forget to check out Ana Luisa. They're only doing their 20% off for a limited time. So if you're interested in anything, definitely snag it up now. And if you guys don't already follow me over on Instagram, definitely go follow me over there. That's where I share all like the real everyday mom life kind of content. I do share it on my channel here as well um, as much as I can. But yeah, if you guys want to keep up with us on a daily basis, definitely go follow me over there. I love you guys so much. I hope you are all doing well and I'll see you in the next video. Bye guys.